Is there something right, written on the wall? Words carved in wood. A farewell message. Brothers, I have to leave. I have not found God to be here with you. The cane of Subprior Remigius shall never again hit my back. Never again. May I sh maybe I shall find God elsewhere. Thomas, September 1134. Probably beyond repair. How much work to build? How much neglect to let it fall apart? Seems to be all that's in there, though. Nowhere else to try. Maybe that'll be. Maybe that'll. The carving will come up at some point, or maybe this is ultimately just a dead end. I sh oh, I should try using the Bible. To repair this, it will need more than my faith. He lost his faith in the Priory, but I hope not his faith in God. Just keep poking around, I suppose? Yeah. Now I'm out here. There you go. You're supposed to be the man near the bridge that knows something about... What happened with the knight? Brother Paul. Freezing. Tries not to let it show. Too cold for someone his age. I know a solution for that. Here, Paul. Oh. Ouch! Oh. <laughs> a hot stone! <laughs> ah! <laughs> It's a mercy, Philip. Thank you. Remedia should give you a fire, or not have you sit here at all. I don't really mind. Winter is bound to end sometime. Philip, if you ever run into trouble with Remedius, be careful to answer him. Do not stay silent. Silent? Nothing makes him angrier than someone who doesn't answer. He becomes weak and defensive. It's not fitting for a sub-prior. Let alone prior. That sounds like advice I might be able to use against him. I can specifically say silent against Remigius if I want to make him seem just bad at being a prior. This hot stone is a blessing, Philip. What did you say again about Remigius's weakness? Nothing makes him angrier than someone who doesn't answer. It's not fitting for a sub prior. What's wrong with your foot, Brother Paul? Oh, just a chillbane. It will ease when the spring comes, and the hot stone really helps, Philip. You should have a fire. It's all right. It's not that cold. Don't take it lightly. Many will die this winter for lack of food or shelter. Remigius thinks the Lord is testing us. Only the sinners perish. No, the poor perish. And those that he has freezing out here. Don't say anything to Remigius, will you? If he thinks I've been complaining, he'll be displeased. Have you heard about a knight in Kingsbridge? A knight? Mm -hmm. Yes. He was just lying by the road, just a mile away from the Priory. He must have fallen from his horse. Where is he now? <sighs> he died. We buried him in the cemetery. Did he have a name? Did he say anything? Oh. He could not speak, but the look in his eyes told me he was afraid. I held his hand and prayed with him while he died. Did the knight have anything with him? Uh, there was a letter. I gave it to Prior James. Remedius will probably burn it with the rest of James's papers. James insisted that all his books and documents shall be burnt after his death, except for his Bible. I heard about this. I think that would be unwise. Sometimes, 
I wonder if it was because of that letter. A few days later, Prior James fell through the ice. Right here, Philip. Maybe I brought a curse on Kingsbridge. How could a letter bring harm? The word of God brings salvation. But what if the devil took to writing? What then? Hmm. Alright, so this is Knight. I had a letter with him. It's probably in the Prior's room. Well, looks like we have another reason to go back there, hopefully before he burns the whole damn place. Let's see. Rough stone. Poking out from the ground. If I were a mason, it might be of use to me. Still all we have here. Alright, let's head back to the Priory then, again. Let's see. Alright. Oh, oh wait, never mind. I was thinking, I was like, oh yeah, we know what to do, let's talk to my... Let's talk to my brother, but no, we need to talk to the prior. Oh. I would like to take a look at Prior James's documents. And why is that, Brother Philip? Well, uh, our little cell has given much to the Mother House. I would like to ensure that all is accounted for. So you do not trust us, Philip, is that it? The state of this priory... The state of this priory is the concern of the Prior of Kingsbridge. I still would like to see the Prior's documents. They will be burned tonight. I heard about that. It was Prior James's last wish. I'm following his request. But the new Prior will be lost without the ledgers and contracts. After the election, I'll be the new Prior. For now, you are not. Only the chapter meeting can decide on these matters. Of course. Brother Andrew will surely understand why you would go against James's last request. <laughs> the sacrist must organize a chapter meeting to save Prior James's documents. Well, now. Hmm. Wizdicha? What? Is that a mistrant? It could be two different things. Some, uh, Didalic does not... They don't start off in English, so maybe it's a word from a different language. Or it might just be somebody rolled their face on a keyboard instead of typing in hmm. <laughs> or maybe it's a word I don't know that refer references the concept of troubled grunting. <laughs> About the chapter meeting. Oh, talk to brother Andrew. He will be just as pleased as me to have you around. Now leave. Talk to Brother Andrew, alright. Many people to keep track of. Never been particularly amazing with names. Neither in the pe neither of the people in the kitchen are Andrew, right? And you're not Andrew, you're Francis. Maybe I should tell you. The letter is probably in the prior's room. But the sub prior is going to burn all of James's documents. What? We cannot allow that to happen, do you hear? Of course not. I should talk to Andrew Sacrist instead. It's the only way. Now I've got the issue of just which character is Andrew Sacrist? No, I'll stay down here. I Why though? I'm protagonist I'm I'm the player. I'll tell you where to go. Oh, it's over here. Oh, the Crypt of Saint... 
and Adolphus. Oh, that's a little downward staircase. I didn't even see that. Oh. Locked. Here Adolphus sleeps until he will be raised at the end of days. Click. Now I have access to this place. Sarcophagus. Let's see what we can find. No reason to be afraid. Nothing here. The saint rests in peace. Pretty casual about searching the sarcophagus of a saint. The remains of Saint Adolphus, one of the 49 martyrs of Cordoba, lying in wait. There's just four directions that are all called darkness. Great. So I, can, I probably can't go this way, right? Can't see. If I look around, my eyes may adjust. Feeling of being watched. These old cathedrals are bound to make strange sounds. Nothing. Oh, is the idea that I'm walking up to dark spots to help my eyes adjust to the environment? Even if it is Adolphus, we would have to welcome him. Thought so. Nothing here. I'm basically just walking up to dark spots to get my eyes to just adjust to them and tell me what's there. Hello? No. No one. Not a thing. Hello? Oh! Is it a spooky bat? There's something up there. Dear Lord. There is something up there. Is that? It looked like a bat when it was moving, but not so much in its huddled form, where it looks like a person with a cowl over themselves. Burr, Bible, do it. The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? What is that? Size of a child, but it flew. What is that? It's the size of a child. Hello. Oh. Oh. An owl. Just an owl. Okay, that explains why it looks like an owl when it's flying, but not at all like an owl when it's not flying. I mean, I mean why it looks like a bat when it's flying, but not when it's not flying. I will contemplate this later. No. Stare lovingly into the owl's eyes. You think you can give it to some give it something, maybe? God will bring with him those who have fallen asleep. Seems likely that's all we're going to find down here for now. I don't see any other passages, I don't think. But I think, isn't that where the, uh... Isn't that where the kids said they say they go to? And the lights are still out. Empty. Body wasn't found. What happened that night? What in God's name happened? For this is the will of my Father, that everyone who looks on the Son and believes in him shall have eternal life, and I will raise him up on the last day. Okay, let's get back to finding this Andrew character. He might be in the guest house, or that, that one building I haven't been able to go in yet. At least it looks well kept. Too early to retire, so I can't go in there still. By the kitchen door? I can ask about this character. Because neither of you are the right person, are you? 
<sighs> it's getting cold. When will these novices learn to close the door? Yeah, you're Milius and Cuthbert. Friar James had a document I would like to see. It's probably amongst the things that Remigius is going to burn. Oh no. He's in the Prior's room. Maybe you can talk him out of it. Remigius told me to have Andrew arrange a chapter meeting. That's the only way to save James's documents. Then there's hope. But Brother Andrew is stubborn. You'll have to be stubborn too when you talk to him. Remigius suggested that I convince the Sacrist to organize a chapter meeting today. In order to save the books and legends. I knew you would do it, and you should. But when it comes to the cellar and my stores, I have all the numbers in my head. It's a shame to waste parchment in ink. So that's information that won't be lost, that's good. I don't know... I don't know if I remember, know who Andrew is, though, or where they are. Uh... Who is Andrew? All these characters to keep track of. Okay. By the way, can I go back there, or what? Winter has taken its toll. Planting a seed's like training a novice. Great things will come of it. I mean, there's no interactive spot around here, I suppose. That's... that's that. And this just brings me, brings me back here, so let's try the back. What do we have to ask oh. ourselves is... Can our Saint Adolphus still protect Kingsbridge in these dark times? He couldn't protect Prior James. Ever since that lightning struck the cathedral, he wasn't the same. When you take over my position as sacrist, you should implore the bishop to send us a new relic. By then, I'll be sub-prior. The new prior and I will support you in this. A new relic might also attract more pilgrims. Philip of Gwyneth, I wanted to talk to you. How dare you disturb Brother Remigius' requiem? I'm... I'm afraid the choir is waiting for me. Stay, brother. There's no reason you shouldn't hear what Philip has to say for himself. I was shocked by the prior's death. We all were. Now, I'm sure at St. John's you're a good prior, but here we adhere to the rules. You mentioned a new prior. The election will be held in a few days, when we all convene for the chapter meeting. We can't allow Prior James's books to be burned. That, Philip, was Prior James's wish. This priory is in debt. And without the ledgers and documents, that will never change. Besides, the wisdom in his books is priceless. It is not up to you to make decisions in this priory, Brother Philip. Do not domineer over those in your charge, but be an example to the flock. 1 Peter, Chapter 5 You are right. You shall argue your case in front of the brothers in a chapter meeting. Today. Thank you, Brother Andrew. When I'm done here, I will tell all the monks to come to the chapter house. Would it help if I went and told some of them? 
Feel free to do that. But I insist that the choir finishes practicing before we start. They're already behind schedule. In order to save prior James's documents, all brothers need to attend the meeting. Oh. All brothers, period, or just... Are you brothers? The, or the young people not count? It's amusing, it's amusing in this because it's like, uh... This is like playing an old Obsidian game, or even a game like, uh... Or even Fallout New Vegas. But instead the uh, instead of having the skill be like ac acrobatics or something like that, your skill you you use to there convince people something. is Bible. He's right. What are they talking about down here? Stop it. Concentrate. There it was again. <gasps> the choir seems distracted. The cantor looks morose. You seem troubled, brother. They won't... They won't sing. It's Adolphus. There was nothing, believe me. I heard him crying in the crypt. I think I heard him too. No, you are mistaken. It sounded like a whip. Like he was chastising himself. It's the end of days. Brother Philip, please help me. Prove to them that there is nothing and no one down there. There is no need to worry, brothers. Adolphus is resting in peace. It was just an owl. I, I told you it was nothing. God bless you, Brother Philip. I knew I heard something. Now, be silent, concentrate, and... Look at me preemptively solving puzzles, basically. Wait, you, you probably count as a brother? Brother Andrew has arranged a meeting. Yes, please go ahead. We will be there in a few minutes. That's what it is. Every character... I need to get every single character to attend the meeting, which means I probably have to solve some sort of problem with some of them that allows them to know that they need to go there. Like, I probably need to deal with the choir thing first, and that was, like, the primary distraction. I probably have to go all the way down here to this guy then, right? There will be a chapter meeting soon. Ah, thank you for letting me know, Philip. Remember my advice about Remagius. To just be quiet and watch him embarrass himself, and then I and then I or somebody else becomes the prior instead because he sucks. There will be a chapter meeting today. You convinced Andrew? Miracles do happen. We will be there. You have our support. There will be a chapter meeting today. Excellent. I can't wait to see you and Remigius quarrel. Brother Cuthbert? Do not worry. We are on your side. <laughs> it's an interesting idea because we're using the idea of uh, how you can stay silent in this kind of game. The, the Walking Dead type games, ever since they've introduced these dialogue systems where there's a time limit, you can just sit the dialogue out entirely. Which led to the manifestation of playthroughs where you play as Silent Lee in the Walking Dead game and you play the most depressing character ever because your character keeps not responding to people as horrible things are happening. But now it's actually a gameplay mechanic you can use to solve a problem. Brother Arnaldus. There's a chapter meeting today. Today, I'll be there. Wouldn't miss that. Now 
Now to check with the kids, I guess. Like, do you count as brothers? A waste of time. A waste of time. That's what the game calls them. Oh man, that's not very nice. That's every character I can think of. The only one I'm not entirely sure certain of is whether or not you count. I could just double check real quick. The sacrist agreed to a meeting today. That way I might be able to get the letter you were looking for. Good thinking, Philip. I will attend, of course. Well, I've, I've told him to attend, at least. Am I missing anyone? I don't think I am. Told them. Went all the way out to get the, get the other guy. Still can't go in the guest house. In the kitchen. Been to the cloister, been to the guy outside. None of the, none of the younger ones count, apparently. I think I've done it. I think I've gone and done it. Also doesn't hurt to save from time to time. I haven't done that for a while. There we go. So same thing for you guys. There will be a chapter meeting in a few minutes. Oh yes, we will be there. Thank you for letting us know. Wait, what? You guys do count. But the other guys don't count? Maybe those guys just really suck. <laughs> I don't know the rules with them. The choir has finished singing. The cantor should find time now. Are you ready for the chapter meeting, Brother Philip? If you have any other business to take care of in Kingsbridge, do it now. The meeting could take a long time. That's a pretty explicit point of no return, isn't it? I'm not ready yet. Let me know when you are. We must begin before nightfall. I I'd try some other dialogue options with you. Let's see. I don't know if we should know about the the uh, the letter necessarily. It is good to see you reading. Even some of our older brothers cannot read or write. Oh, we yeah. must teach them. <laughs> Reading the words we can teach them, but understanding them. It is easier to simply tell them what is written in the scripture. Look at me pandering to my audience. 